May I present Mistress Brianna McKenzie? Have we met before, Mistress McKenzie? Tobias Menzies has confirmed that he won't be coming back as Jack in Season 8. But who else won't be returning and who will? Let's dive into all the details about the cast changes for Outlander Season 8 and what you need to know. Let's start with a definitive answer on whether there will be an Outlander Season 9. Unfortunately, there won't be. Outlander is ending with Season 8. However, Meryl Davis has hinted to Decider that she might want to return to adapt more of Diana Gabaldon's future books. If it was just up to Meryl Davis, I would love to see this through to the end of the book series, she said. Maybe we'll do a different iteration in the future. You know, maybe we'll come back and tell the end of the story. When Decider asked stars Sam Hewen and Katrina Balfe if they'd be open to returning, Balfe responded, I think you never say never. The door's always open, so we'll see. Now, let's dive into which cast members will be returning for Season 8 and who won't be making a comeback. With stars confirming that Seasons 7 and 8 will bring Claire and Jamie's love story to an epic conclusion, it's clear that Katrina Balfe and Sam Hewen will reprise their roles as Claire and Jamie Frazier. Since Season 8 will be based on Diana Gabaldon's ninth book, Go Tell the Bees That I'm Gone, viewers can also expect to see Sophie Skelton's Brianna and Richard Rankin's Roger as their characters remain crucial to the unfolding story. On the flip side, Tobias Menzies, who portrayed the complex and villainous Jack Randall, has confirmed he will not return for Season 8. His departure means fans will miss the intense dynamic he brought to the series, but the show will carry on focusing on the evolving saga of the Fraser family and their allies. Here's a closer look at the cast likely to appear in Season 8. Katrina Balfe as Claire Fraser will undoubtedly be a significant presence, given her central role throughout the series. Her journey as a time-traveling doctor and loving wife has been pivotal, and it's crucial to see how her story wraps up. Similarly, Sam Hewen's portrayal of Jamie Fraser has been a cornerstone of the series. His return for the final season is essential as the narrative draws to a close, continuing to explore his struggles, growth, and the profound bond he shares with Claire. Sophie Skelton's Brianna Fraser will also make a return. Brianna, as Claire and Jamie's daughter, has evolved significantly and her role remains central as the series concludes. Roger McKenzie, played by Richard Rankin, will likewise be back. Roger's character has been deeply intertwined with the Fraser family saga and his presence will be important for resolving ongoing plot lines. In addition, Cesar Domboy will return as Fergus Fraser, a beloved character whose relationship with the Frasers has been both heartfelt and complex. Lauren Lyle's Marsali Fraser, Fergus's wife and Jamie's daughter-in-law, will continue to be part of the series. Marsali's strength and resilience have always been notable and her interactions with the Fraser family will remain significant. John Bell's young Ian, Jamie's nephew, will also be featured. Young Ian's journey, marked by personal challenges and growth, will contribute to the resolution of various storylines. Kristen Atherton will reprise her role as Jenny Murray, Jamie's sister. Jenny's strong presence has always been vital to Jamie's story, and her return will bring emotional depth to the final season. David Berry's Lord John Gray will return as well, adding layers to the series with his complex relationship with Jamie and his own personal struggles. Additionally, Charles Vandervart will continue to play William Ransom, Jamie's son. William's journey and his connection with his family have been central to the narrative, and his role will be crucial to the series' final chapter. Lastly, Izzy Meckley Small will return as Rachel Hunter. Her involvement in significant storylines will continue to impact the series as it reaches its conclusion. As Outlander heads to its final season, the return of these cast members ensures that fans will see the storylines they've followed for years come to a satisfying end. While Tobias Menzies' absence will be felt, the remaining cast members will continue to bring depth and emotion to the series, wrapping up the epic tale of love, adventure, and time travel that has captivated audiences for so long. While details about Season 8 are still coming in, Diana Gabaldon has revealed that the final season will primarily adapt her ninth book. This novel throws Jamie and Claire's relationship into new turmoil as the American Revolutionary War threatens to disrupt their lives and the stability of their family. Additionally, the book explores further complications for Brianna, Roger, and their family caused by the villainous Rob Cameron, a major character from Season 7. 
the story deepens their fears of being pursued by more conspirators. Depending on how the writers handle the adaptation and how much of the book's content is covered in Season 7, it seems likely that Season 8 will focus on these critical plot developments. New images from Outlander Season 7 Part 2 have surfaced, giving fans a glimpse into what's next for Jamie and Claire as they navigate the second-to-last season of this historical fantasy. Season 7 will continue adapting Diana Gabaldon's books, focusing on the beloved pair as they journey through time. The previous season ended with Jamie appearing incapacitated after the first Battle of Saratoga, leaving his fate in the Revolutionary War uncertain. Nevertheless, the trailers for Part 2 suggest that his story with Claire is far from over. TV Line has released new photos from the upcoming episodes, showing that much of the season remains set in Scotland during the Revolutionary War. Meanwhile, Brianna is seen in the 1970s interacting with the police, adding another layer to the unfolding drama. These images highlight the ongoing tension in Jamie and Claire's relationship, as Jamie risks his life as a rifleman while the couple struggles to fully reconnect amidst the chaos of the times. Despite these challenges, their love endures, and they hold on to hope for a better future. The new photos indicate that Jamie and Claire are determined to overcome their current predicament, even if it means confronting fate head-on. Their interactions with other characters, such as Ian and Lord John, suggest potential separations in Part 2, which will likely drive the plot forward. Meanwhile, Brianna's conversations with the police hint at a subplot involving her son's kidnapping, though her exact role in the ongoing story remains unclear. With many elements from Gabaldon's book series still to be explored, Outlander is gearing up for its conclusion in Season 8. The couple faces numerous obstacles as their lives become increasingly complex, and it's clear that the road to a satisfying ending will be fraught with challenges. As the story continues to unfold, fans can expect plenty of twists and turns before Jamie and Claire's journey reaches its final chapter. And lastly, it's worth noting that Outlander creators are fully aware of what's been missing from recent seasons of the show. The Highlands and Scotland, which were central to the show's early charm, have been noticeably absent in the later seasons. In the beginning, Outlander was not only set primarily in Scotland, but also delved deeply into the political ramifications of Jamie and his allies' struggles against the English. As Moore is also an executive producer on the upcoming Outlander prequel, his recognition of these fan concerns is promising. It suggests that the new direction for the franchise will likely honor the elements that longtime fans have cherished, potentially bringing back some of the elements that made the show so compelling in its earlier days. And that's that for today's video. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next one. Your suggestions for future videos are always welcome in the comments below.